Hey, it's Dr. McLean with Vital Energy Chiropractic, where our goal is to optimize your health so you can live an amazing life, an abundant life. So I'm gonna talk about today is very relevant to that too, right now, but also to your future in terms of health. Listen to some of these numbers. 60% of Americans have at least one chronic disease. 40% of Americans have at least two chronic diseases. 20, this one just breaks my heart. 25% of children have at least one chronic disease. So you're setting up these children for a lifetime of suffering, of pain, of medications, and a shorter life, more than likely. Now, wrap your head around this one. This is gonna shock you. 90% of our healthcare costs are spent on chronic diseases, chronic diseases. Now, listen to this. The definition of chronic is lasting, for a long period of time marked by frequent reoccurrence as in certain diseases. Another definition is subject to a habit or pattern of behavior for a long time. So one of the things you have to understand with these diseases is we have to do things typically to continue to perpetuate these diseases or at least not correct the cause of what's going on right now in our body. Remember, your body is wired for health. It's designed for health. So, just like hopefully you've got a financial plan for your future, right? You're putting money aside. So if you ever decide to retire or just in the future, you have money set aside, you put into some type of retirement or an investment and it grows over time. And then you have hopefully a pile of money that you can use in the future. Well, the same thing happens with health and disease. So we chronically do things over and over and over. It accumulates in our body and we create this chronic disease. But what we want to do here in this office is we want to create chronic health because the same thing happens. You accumulate health and you can do very little things that abundance and grow over time. So just like if you're setting aside time for your side for your money and it's growing over time, you set a same thing for your health. And so with our diseases, you got to recognize what the cause of that is, have a plan to interrupt that cause, you know, Type 2 diabetes is actually very simple to correct. It's not easy, it takes some energy and effort, but the benefits are huge. Now, the other thing to understand, just from a financial perspective, if, if you just looked at financially, the number one cause of bankruptcy in our country is medical bills and medical debt. Well, if we're spending 90% of our healthcare costs on chronic disease, we can eliminate a massive amount of it. So, it's not just about accumulating wealth for financially, it's being able to hold on to that money, right? So if you accumulate some money, but also you've got a $100,000 bill or $200,000 bill, it's gonna deplete a lot of that money very, very quickly. And that's what happens, unfortunately, these chronic diseases, over time, they cost hundreds of thousands of dollars, or you develop a specific, you have a heart attack or cancer, and all at once you have to spend a ton of money, right? Now we can't control what's gonna to happen to us in the future. We can control our daily actions and we can really simple things again that are gonna build chronic health. And that's what I want you to focus on. Just little things repeated over time. Get your spinal adjustments. Most thing you can, uh, most important thing you can do, get the pressure off your nervous system. So your brain can communicate with your body. Physically can move the right way. Then we just start putting a little bit of healthier foods in our body, right? We avoid some of the bad foods. We get out in the sunshine. We physically move in some really simple things the pharmaceutical industry doesn't want you to know that. The medical community, a lot of them anyway, not all of them, don't want you to know that. They don't want you to know that you're wired for health. You've got this power inside of you. You don't have to do a lot. Just do these simple things, repeat them over time, and then don't interfere with it. So again, you do that, you're gonna have abundant health. And you're gonna be able to not only have the finances to enjoy your retirement, be able to have the health to enjoy your retirement.